I'm going to be doing this uh, video with some commentary today. The barn rod, that's the finished product. A five horse hit and miss rat rod truck. And here's the video. I'm a low tech guy here. Bear with me. Anyhow, here we go. Get some volume going. All right. Engine's 110 years old, weighs 1,200 pounds. Got a chain drive going to an angle gear. That angle gear goes to a stub shaft to a four speed, three quarter ton transmission. That's a three quarter ton Chevrolet frame. Chose that because of the weight of the engine. There's an axle flip onto the front. There's four extra springs on each side to keep the front end stout. Uh, just uh, keep keep this thing uh, from not uh, jumping around. And that includes uh, eight pounds of uh, lead into each of the flywheels for balancing. Uh, you guys uh, that uh, may be seeing this for the first time, I have a Facebook page. Antique engines, repowered vehicles and builds. On there you can see a whole lot more of the build and other people's projects. But uh, this is something that I was wanting to do for a long time for this project. And this day uh, of its first day driving out of the shop, uh, this happened uh, November 23rd, 2019, was a very exciting day for me because uh, all the planning and prep and stuff on it, this thing works. It was, uh, the engine is running at about uh, 225 RPM. Uh, I've increased that RPM up to 300 and got a lot more, uh, more power, horsepower or torque uh, out of that engine. The whole vehicle weighs uh, 4,640 pounds. Uh, that's without me in it. And uh, so this thing is just a tank. So anyway, I am uh, been hauling this thing this uh, summer here to uh, the different car shows because that's what's been going on. The tractor shows all, most of them all uh, got canceled, but taking this to the car shows, uh, just a tremendous response. Uh, this thing has been an absolute rock star. Here's my finish line finish. Oh, uh, yeah, I say to my good buddy here that uh, I don't know if you heard that, but I said that it is no longer an expensive lawn ornament. It actually works. It's just a, absolutely a great day for me. And uh, anyhow, I live, I'm here in central Wisconsin. And I'll be doing some more car shows here into the spring and summer and fall again for next year. But hopefully get this COVID behind us and uh, we can have ourselves uh, some tractor shows again. Uh, and I also want to include that uh, a lot of good people uh, helped me out with this project. And you know who you guys are. Thank you and thank you and thank you so much for helping me out. Uh, that's absolutely been this thing's been a rock star and hope to see you at the show. Tell me you've seen the video. Hey, maybe you get lucky and uh, I can take you guys for a ride. Bye-bye.